Lithuania is ramping up its efforts to support Ukraine by preparing a new package of military aid. The Lithuanian Minister of National Defense, Arvidas Anasauskas, announced this initiative during the NATO Defense Ministers' meeting in Brussels, held from October 11 to 12. For the first time, Ukrainian President Volodymyr Zelensky was also present at the event. The new package includes NASAM's anti-aircraft missile launchers and 155mm caliber ammunition for the Ukrainian armed forces. These munitions will be ordered in collaboration with certain EU member states. Anasauskas emphasized that Lithuania is tailoring its aid packages to meet Ukraine's most pressing needs and priorities. The Norwegian, or National, Advanced Surface-to-Air Missile System, commonly known as NASAMS, is a missile defense system that has been in service since 1997. Developed as a collaborative effort between Norway and the United States, this system was designed and manufactured by Kongsberg Defense and Aerospace in conjunction with Raytheon Missiles and Defense. Unlike many other systems that require a large team to operate, NASAMS is designed to be highly efficient, requiring only a two-person crew. This not only reduces labor costs but also facilitates its deployment in various operational scenarios. In terms of performance, NASAMS is highly versatile, with different versions offering varying capabilities. The NASAMS-2, equipped with the AMRAM missile, has an effective firing range of 30 kilometers. On the other hand, the more advanced NASAMS-3, which uses the AMRAM R missile, extends this range to 50 kilometers. The system's radar capabilities are also impressive. The NASAMS-2, fitted with the MPQ-64 F1 radar, has a radar track range of 120 kilometers, providing ample time for decision-making and engagement of incoming threats. The NASAMS-2 can engage targets at altitudes up to 21 kilometers, while the NASAMS-3, with its AMRAM R missile, can reach altitudes as high as 35.7 kilometers. This high altitude capability makes it a crucial component in defending against a wide range of aerial threats, from low flying drones to high altitude bombers. In addition to military aid, Lithuania is also preparing to provide electrical generators and other essential equipment to help Ukraine prepare for the winter season. Earlier, at the end of June, Lithuanian President Kitanis Nauseda had announced that two NASAMS anti aircraft missile launching systems, purchased by Lithuania, would arrive in Ukraine in September. This announcement comes in a context where other countries, such as the United Kingdom and the United States, have also announced military aid packages for Ukraine. The UK recently announced military aid worth over £100 million sterling, while the Biden administration has announced aid valued at $200 million.